take me back to sort of the, the, your history as an artist. Tell me a little bit of what, what you do, what your aesthetic is. Um, I'm from Finland and uh, I, I used to study uh, graphic design in a, in a small town called Lahti in Finland. And uh, actually my, my first dream was to become an architect, but because uh, my math is not very good, I actually never got into the architecture school, so I, I, I went to the art school, in, art school instead. I really like, uh, like 60s pop art, uh, kind of like 60s psychedelia. I like folk art like um, kind of like outsider art, all kinds of things like um, uh, inspire me. How do those interests and preferences fit into this mural that we're seeing today? I was asked to create something uh, that is uh, very kind of like liquid. It's kind of like liquid movement in a way. Uh, I was asked to create something like that is very colorful and right. really kind of like exploding out of the walls. So, uh, so I was really happy to actually uh, to, to do something like this. What are your thoughts on the whole integrating Twitter and social media into your artwork? Uh, everybody can kind of like take part in creating this image, like by tweeting about it, and then also uh, kind of uh, supporting Canadian artists at the same time. I think that was a great, uh, great idea. Well, Molson's called us, yeah. and um, they said they were very frank and said we've never done this before. It's never been done before to have this sort of tweet fundraising campaign in a way or this tweet campaign we don't know what's going to happen it's an experiment and I really like that and I mean the art world is all about experimentation so as you know for every tweet there's a dollar that's being donated to our foundation so obviously lots of people walking by today uh, some people stopping by and taking a look at this mural what do you want them to experience or take away from what you've created here it's, it's very unexpected like when like people are just walking here and they just suddenly see something and like they, I think the great thing about art is that like uh, everybody can kind of like experience it in their own ways.